Hey guys, we're at this old home site. This house dates back to like the 1750s. So uh, there's a lot of cool stuff inside. The top floor probably hasn't been used since the uh, 60s, although these stairs don't look wicked old, but no one's lived up here for a very long time. So let's just head up. Yeah, a little sketchy stairs, but you know. They seem to be sturdy for now. This was not us. We found that just like that. The old radio there. That's pretty cool. And that's an old. I think it's an old TV. Raytheon. Little bird nest in the corner. You see, there's stuff everywhere. Going in the attic, where there's a lot of old stuff. So yeah, someone wants to come in here at one point before us and toss things around a lot. Maybe looking for valuables. But we're just here to try to save some history. That old Heinz ad right there. That's it. Old Montgomery Ward bullet box. Not about dry milk. Oh yeah, I found some of the bullets from that last time. Really? Yeah. And here is the kitchen. Something dated 1920 that I'm probably going to take. Handwritten. Handwritten. The old Glenwood stove. Someone likes shells. Some fruit jars. That's the uh, lantern top. Oh, that's the old soap dish. I didn't see that last time. I like those. The old fridge. This is a, it says MW. I don't know what that stands for, but I checked it's not full of nasty stuff. It's just, uh, someone cleaned it out. I found a shovel for the fridge. Oh, nice. Oh, old coal shovel. Sweet. I guess in this bathroom here was a newer addition because uh, they had a uh, outhouse in the back. Nice blue tile. Yeah, it's a big old trunk here someone was tossing around. It's a shame. I wish it was a little more intact. Someone just really kind of did a number this place. We're just. Looking for the aftermath. Look at this. A little dining room here. These little, uh, neat things here. Some sort of receipt for stuff. All these little books everywhere. Theory of Evolution, 1929, right there. Letters, the old stamp. That's super cool. This, oh, that was, that's pretty cool looking. It's got, yeah, it's got shit, but very neat. That's creepy, isn't it? Life of Webster. How old is this one here? Should be a date somewhere. Daniel Webster. Come on. Oh, I'm not seeing a date. No, oh, here we go. 1854, I think. Let's see, it says, come on, focus. Yeah, 1,854. Wow, that's old. That's really old. Awesome. All the, uh, yeah, wow, I'm totally having a brain fart.
Wallpaper, yeah, that's the stuff, right? It's all falling off. Old bingo. <laughs> or that way, statistical stuff. I mean, maybe this guy worked in the railway. That'd be cool. Something about wandering Arabs. More books. Really old Civil War book. See, I'm gonna guess it's from like the 60s or 50s. 55. More dictionaries. Old receipts. It. Look at that. See, it's like an old ice skate. Ugh. Yeah. Don't make them like that anymore, do they? It's pretty cool. An old uh, tennis racket. Someone smashed that. Shame. Old football. Not sure what that said on there. It's too bad it's all chipped off. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna turn this off and do a little searching. Yeah. Alright, just found some very nice uranium glass shakers. I'm guessing it's shawl and pepper. The labels are a little far gone, but it's still a nice uranium glass. This is a cool dispenser bottle. You hold it from there, like uh, very UV uh, stuff. This one, we just tore through this room pretty, pretty roughly. It had been really um, got a number on it. Um, whoever came in here before us, you can see there's just, there's just letters everywhere, clothing everywhere. Um, we just found a few cool things. Um, a little like cup there. 1931 National Geographic. Good old toilet seat bar hinge. Good stuff. Bunch of a. Uh, Old cold tip pens, pen heads, a nice uh, Horlix malted milk with the matching top. Was that gonna focus? There we go. So, yeah, the old bed frame. And I found some stuff underneath that uh, Vero there. But yeah, there's just, just looking through so much stuff. It's a shame. If this is all like had been. Um, not destroyed by whoever came in here first. It's much easier to look through stuff and keep it neat, but, you know, people are crazy. And let's see. In the kitchen is some nice fruit jars. In the window here. Typical, let's see, you got Dre and Prude, Everseal, Atlases. Mostly atlases, but nice looking shelves. A bunch of random little uh, kitchen implements. This is some sort of space heater. Comforter, comfortier. Nifty. And then like, if you want to get really uh, adventurous, you go down like, under the uh, kitchen and this back. And there's just like, you know, all sorts of stuff in here. There's brick. Clark brick? I never heard of a Clark one. Bunch of old paper in there. I see a comb. So uh, not much left of it. But some cool stuff. Alright. Till next uh, update. Alright okay, guys, I'm in an attic here. I, just, I, can, I can't see the dust unless I look in the camera. And it's just chock full of stuff. I can't focus with the dust. There's like... Old books. Stuff. This, this one here is uh, 1845. Look at that. Wow. That's the oldest I've seen. 
a bunch of letters here from the 20, uh, 1920s. And I was looking at this stuff all over the place. This is insane. But yeah, I should need a mask. Cool little lock plate. Oh yeah, this is really cool. That is an old woman's corset right there. Taking that with me. Very cool. Old umbrella. Someone collected seashells. This is an old oil lamp piece. Yeah, this is wild.